Hey guys, Chrome Tyrell here, welcome to another episode, I believe it's episode 3 of Sword E Shenanigans. This is a Warframe, sort of a series, I don't know how else to frame it. Ha! That where I do the daily sortie. So we're gonna see what we got here, and see if I need anybody to help me. Sabotage, rescue, and assassination. Oh boy! Uh, sabotage on Uranus? Huh. Bow only, okay, I think we can handle that easy enough. I've got this Jug Prime here. Yeah, no. If you, oh, they, they, uh, the, the interface has been altered. I take Wukong for this simply because he can move fast. If you don't have the Nadaruk, which is a reward from one of the Rewards from the new war quest. You can use practically any other bow you want. I mean, the Dread. The Dread is a pretty good bow. The Kuva Brahma is a pretty good bow as well. But you may not have a Kuva Brahma. Oop. Let's get the extractor stuff first. It's a good way to passively get stuff moving. While well, you're not there and can't play Warframe actively. Now let's do it again. Sabotage. I can't remember. Well, I'm gonna find out. We'll find out here quite soon. I don't know if this is the one where you have to stop the underwater experiment or which one it might be. And if it will perhaps get a move upon. There we go. This nice cloud is walker. the birthplace of some of the most dangerous ah. prisoner to date. The pump Knock station. it out of commission. Two seconds into this and I'm already lost. Do we have to go under water? Oh no. Nope. I was gonna say not yet. We may still have to go under water. This is a leaky old tub, man. I guess we couldn't pay the maintenance fees on this thing. is I think the one with the experiment. Okay, so we want to go down here. Yeah. And just shoot these pipes. Actually they're not like they're more like flaps. Good. Now start the pumps and flood this place. And all we gotta do this is basically a mobile defense mission with one now. Uh, the pumps have started. Guard the controls. The grenier must not stop the flooding. Let's go to the cave, 
think you have to push a few more buttons. I'm pretty sure. You can, if you have a melee, which I don't, you can just do a slam attack to get down here a lot faster. Everything else. And here I was jabbering about mobility and all that. Not using Cogwalk as efficiently as I could have. Till Gregor's newest creations. Make sure it never sees the surface. Oh hey, there is stuff to do. What gonna do is like, huh. oh, we gotta. Sabotage the project. Okay. It's been too long since I actually did this mission. Get Clem! Oh. There's some pipes here. Okay. Insert Grenier Toxin. Requires Grenier Toxin. Well, well, well. Uh, hmm. Oh, wow. Did we get him? Your work is done. Huh. Okay, so I incorrectly determined how to do that. And now it's on to the next thing. One of the most ridiculous things that I have a dislike for rescue missions with energy deduction, only because I mainly rely on Wukong. I think we can still make it work on this one. I mean, it's just a rescue. It's probably, depending on where it is, it's one of the easier ones. This should be relatively straightforward, then, I think. Because it's not the one like it's Uranus where it's underwater, or Uranus. Anyway. Because yeah, we got instead of 300 energy, we got like 110. Search for the hostage and bring them home. I mean, I have. You can kind of cheese it if you have a recipe in your dojo that you research for energy resource, or you can just bullet jump. I mean, either way, it's just faster. Completed the new or completed uh, the, the war within and uh, the, moment you enter the, the one before that. I can't the remember the name of it right now. To get an operator and you're running Zenrit. It's a not quite a similar. The pizzas are better, but the energizing dash from Zenrit is good in a pinch. Because, yeah, right now I'm not going to have enough to get me The hostage is almost out of time. Hurry. We've reached the prison. Find our prisoner in one of these cells. That one, okay. Oh, 
another cool thing about Wu Kong is that uh, he can go, well, one is he can go invisible with his immortal techniques, but if you die... He can uh, revive himself up to, I think it's three times per battle. And he can also do the one where he's invisible for however many seconds it is. And if you're invisible, you usually, usually, there are probably exceptions to it, but I don't think there are very many, you can usually be targeted. Like you usually cannot be targeted. I'm sorry, cannot be targeted. Unless like, I think some acolytes on the steel path will still like path for you if you're invisible. But otherwise, I mean, this obviously is not steel path to speak of at all. All right. So this is the last one. This is an assassination mission on Mars, which means it's Lieutenant Lech Grill. The same one as in the Warframe level tours video. Only now he's going to be between level 80 and 100, likely closer to 100. But the procedure is the same. Which is helpful. And also, without that pesky energy reduction, I'll have way more energy. Contracts are not to be taken lightly. Eliminating this target will have a significant impact on enemy forces. Search the area. I remember the last time I was here. I played this on public. Krill is aware of your presence. I think it was Strike the last first. time. I'm pretty sure on the story difficulty. Where, uh, I think Krill a couple of the people who are there with me wanted to have the battle spell. last as long as possible because they wanted to show off their weapons that they had and they were like making the battle last so long. But anyway, I ended up having to abandon that mission because I actually, you know, wanted to get the reward for the mission and get out of there. Oh, I was gonna say, my clone took too much damage. Oh, there he is. Of course that would interrupt me. Hey, Krill, hold on. There we go. Gotta make sure he uses the hammer on the down level. on fire you can just hit him wherever you want and it doesn't matter because after the pipes are broken he catches fire and then, yeah. there's also look there was also curia on the ledge over over and around that if you scan it I think it's part of some collection I don't think I have all the curia nope oh my god this wasn't too bad I mean, I've gotten okay reward. 6,000 Kuva isn't a bad reward if you're looking for Kuva or you like to roll ribbons and what have you. 
All right, that'll be the end of this one. I appreciate you guys hanging out. Be sure to like, favorite, and subscribe if you enjoyed, or if you learned something today, be able to go ahead and ring the bell, hit the notification jazz to let YouTube know that that's what uh, is going on for you. Keep on going with your gaming journey and your life journey too. We will catch you all in the next one. See you.